Through PASCO Housing, we are able to provide move-in assistance, case management for up to a year, as well as help them financially for um, a period of time until they uh, obtain stability. But we help them in guidance through a service plan, which is mostly just goals that they make. We work with them to achieve those goals. Through financial support and stability, we help them with their rent, their utilities, move-in assistance. If they need transportation, we get the bus passes. Um, we're able to help them with, you know, possibly medical care, depending on the program, and getting them to where they need to go. So if they want to go to school, we work with the schools to see what they would be approved for. So if we don't have that financial assistance, we find it for the clients so they are able to achieve self-sufficiency. Of course, it's tough for any parent, but I mean, to never be homeless and then now you're homeless with your kids. Catholic Charities helped me as far as being able to work. My kids were able to stay at the shelter. You know, they would be able to go there after school without me. So that freed me up to find work. Um, Jessica with Catholic Charities told us about a, a program, I think it was Rapid Rehousing. When um, this place came available, uh, she said all she'd have to do is uh, um, inspection and then they'd be able to assist with the move-in expenses. I um, found a job closer because I, I don't like being too far away from the kids obviously. I'd like to thank the people across the diocese who support this ministry through APA that allowed us to have a home and get moved in and get settled in and have somebody to call and kind of help us through our rough patch.